The instruction has super easy 5 steps. All the links I have put in the description down below. Just follow the instruction and you can play your game. Today I will show you how to install Flight Cover to play more game on the M1 MacBooks. Don't matter, MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, Mac Mini, whatever. Just M1. It will work. Okay, let's begin. You go to flycover.me, choose download for Apple Silicon right here. You open the download file and drag it to application like this. Yes, that's it. Drag it to application. Okay, now you try to open it. Some of you might have the error like this. Don't worry, we will fix this very easy. You uh, hit command swiper, search for system preference. Go to security and privacy right here. In the general tab, you will see this lock icon. Click it and enter your password to open it. Yeah, you see it open anyway. It's notification array. Open it and then fly cover will pop up. That's it. If you don't see the open anyway notification there, try to open fly cover again and it will pop up right there. How to install any games and app in fly cover. If you are watching a specific video of mine, which means I have put the Google Drive link down below, you have the IPI file and the key map file in there. Or you can go to the Discord server in the scripted IPI file right here, find your game, and then download it. It's all the same. I download from the same short, okay? Next, to install your game, you open uh, Flight Cover, click Add App, and then choose the app you have just downloaded the IPI tail right here and then install it. Wait for it to install. Done! Your app is here. Now you can open and fly the game but there will be one problem. You cannot control the game with your mouse and keyboard. So I will teach you how to do it in two simple ways. Let's go. The first and the simple way is to import key mapping into the game. That's it. Other people have already made key mapping for you. You just need to download and import it to your game. I already put the key mapping file in the, f the Google Drive folder. Just download it, right click on your app and choose import key mapping. That's it. Choose the key mapping file you just downloaded. And then click open. That's it. When you open the game, you already can control your character with your mouse and keyboard. The second and the harder way is to customize your key mapping. If you are not like uh, not satisfied with the key mapping other people make, you can change here and there in the key mapping setting. To open the key map setting, you hit Command K. Command K and the setting will appear. But you will not see anything like this. I already made the key map. Unless you import something, it will show the key map right here. So to change here and there, I need you to remember something. Right click to see this circle. Did you see this circle right here? Right click and this circle right here. This is the key map setting. It will have you to add something. This is to add right mouse. This is the middle mouse. This is the way you look, to look around in your game. This is the joystick. The joystick right here. Yeah, this is the joystick. To move in your game. That's it. Oh, remember the joystick. Uh, the joystick in some game is at the center. You have to put the joystick right in the center of that center. This way is to add a single mouse click like this. You can click that. It will add a mouse click for you. I like set T something. That's it. When you're done, you hit Command K and it will automatically save for you. Now you can enjoy your game.